Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It's Monday afternoon, and here are today's notices. First of all, a reminder that the sign-up sheets for this week's Eden Society events are in Brunel Hirsch and the Dudley Room. Uh, talk on Tuesday is on media and entertainment. On Thursday, there's a talk on careers in law. You need to sign up for both talks by half past five today if you wish to attend. Uh, also, the following low six students have not replied to the trip information for Florence. Please send your details to Miss Loudon ASAP and pay the deposit online. That's Mir Wade. Alex Caligas, Brayley, Lewis Quimbauer and Yasha, please get that sorted so that we can get that trip up and running. Now then, we are three weeks out from the end of term. We are one week out from, well, less than one week, five days until the first performance of Oliver. Um, and also only two weeks from trials for year seven to ten. Uh, so... <clears throat> We're going to start to talk a bit more about revision, um, and particularly those of you in year 7 to 10, how you can best go about revising, which is also helpful for year 11 as well. Um, this morning I want to mention cue cards, because I've been having a conversation with Mrs Dawson about cue cards, about the best way to use cue cards, because both of us think they are probably the best way to do your revision, and I wanted to share the tip that Mrs Dawson gave me. I can't find it. So cue cards, little bits of paper, about yay big. I hope to have some for an example. And Mrs Dawson said that the best thing she could think of to revise was to write questions on one side of the card, to write the answers on the other side of each card, to keep them organised by topic, by subject, in little boxes, um, and then to test yourself with the questions and put them into two parts, the ones that you know, the ones that you don't know, and keep working on the ones that you don't know until you know them all. So um, this is kind of as much for parents as students as go and get some cue cards, buy them, they come in little plastic boxes, keep them nicely organised. Um, because that will help with your revision. I'll try and find some for tomorrow's notices so I can show you exactly what I mean, but I couldn't find any today. Um, I'm wandering up to the boarding house because look, we've got Christmas trees, it's a little bit of Christmas in the air, it's all starting to feel very festive up here in the boys' boarding house. Um, look at that, isn't that lovely? Um, and I believe there are more Christmas decorations going up around the school. Uh, what else do I have to tell you about? Uh, Oliver Cast was down there this morning at the rehearsal. I'm heading back down this afternoon. It's looking fantastic. Thank you so much for all of your efforts, parents. Thank you for your support. Uh, Mrs. Bryant's sterling work as ever. Um, oh yeah, lower sixth committees. I've got provisional committee membership sorted. I'm going to send it out via email this afternoon. There's just one or two people I wanted to speak to first um, and then we'll try and arrange some meetings this week. If we can't get all the committees to meet this week we will aim to at least get the social committee and the community committee together this week because there's things they need to do pronto um, and it might be that the first meetings of the other committees will end up being next week. But I think that's it from me today. Have a lovely afternoon. I'll see you all same time tomorrow. Take care. Bye.